yes guys welcome back to a new vlog i'm actually on my way to sea point at the moment as we pass a aston martin repeat um, now the weather from this angle doesn't particularly look that bad but it is a little bit grim that side so yeah we're gonna see what we can see today i'm pretty sure we'll still see some pretty epic stuff but uh yeah stay tuned jeez when last have i seen a chrome gold wrap that's like 2010 shit got a very nice lamborghini urus so i think i'm just gonna stop here at the usual spot and see what we can see from here um, this is where i like to sit it's just easy to see the cars come past, as uh, you guys know from previous vlogs. But yeah, let's see what we can see in a few minutes over here. Oh, speaking of, looks like that had a carbon bonnet on that M4. Very interesting. I absolutely love to see these. GLS 600 Maybach. Still love these uh, SVRs, F-Tops. Very cool cars. trying to talk there but yeah the exhaust on that one is as um, red hot as the red one that we saw in a previous spotting vlog let's see how far we can follow this thing it sounds so good man it sounds so good glad to see another performance on the streets of Cape Town yeah look at that oh what a legend he's driving this thing properly. through the traffic earlier <laughs> content I've actually gotten from today oh look at this thing man I think I'm gonna let him go <laughs> oh my goodness oh that was so sick that was so sick thank you to the owner oh my goodness what a legend what an absolute legend so I'm back here in Seapoint now after having a bit of fun with the uh, Performante. Yo, that was uh, actually really, really fun. Nice to see him enjoying the car like that. But also, um, I am going to go and look at the VNA down there to see what's lurking around there and also sort of the back roads. So uh, yeah, let's just catch one or two more spots here and then we'll head down that side. Looks like we have another Urus. This time a yellow one with the uh, yellow tire writing. Now this is pretty cool, the brand new Aston Martin DBX 707, that's pretty cool. So I came across this very nice Porsche 992 Turbo S finished in crayon grey, but not only that, check the interior, red with uh, sort of cream or white leather, absolutely stunning spec this, very very beautiful. 
very nice to see a park chair but not only that we have something else down the road which i'll show you and uh here it is the mclaren 720s very very cool love to see it here yeah, i didn't expect it to leave so soon <laughs> Just walking back and I see it coming back past. Very, very cool. And there she goes. Sat in traffic. There is actually quite a lot of cars in Seapoint today. It's so full. So I came across this very nice Ford Pista. It's been a while since I've actually seen one of them on the roads. Very, very cool. Always loved the Pista. And then, not only that, but if we have a look, have a little peek down there, you can see there's a nice hurricane, but it's not just any hurricane. So yeah, let's have a look at this. I mean, this thing not only has a bit of kit on it, like you can see the front splitter and the rear wing, it is also, if you wait for it, twin turbo. How insane is that? I really want to hear this thing. It's the first time I've actually seen this one parked up. Check up, check the exhaust setup. It's insane. It looks so good. That sounds mean. Damn, that's a pretty cool combo. So, I mean, following this, and there's an R34 there as well. That's insane. This thing is so rare. R50 VW with not only that, a Supra. Check that out. That is pretty sick combo. That. So here's the R34 over here, right? And then the Supra, and then the R50 came past, and then the Huracan came past. I mean, I can't even keep up. This is absolutely insane. I mean, that combo, absolute JDM wet dream. Slightly out of breath. Loving the new plate, Renzo. <laughs> no peace. And there goes the Supra. Second time. So the Supra just parked up. It's, uh, Gonna pop the engine for us. So let's just have a look, see this beast. Nice. Ooh, so small. <laughs> oh, there's Renzo, that Renzo again. Looking so good. Yo. You got a black one and a red one, but this is a daily. The others are correct only. <laughs> Yo. Just got that California tea. And we have the EDX over there, where it usually is. I'm not gonna lie, there are some proper cars out today. I mean, here's a 991.2 GT3 RS that was on the Thunder Tour, which happened over the past week in uh, the Western Cape. Pretty sick to see this. I mean, this is probably the highlight on the run, if I'm honest with you. But uh, yeah, very, very cool to see it parked up here. Also saw a 458 come past, which I just missed. So yeah, I mean, some really, really good cars out today, gents. The scene is coming back to life. So I came across another GT3 RS. This is a different one to the one we saw parked up. Very, very cool. I don't think this one's a bicycle pack, whereas the other one was. And there it goes. 
also got the 570 spider from the previous spotting vlog very cool yeah so i'm just gonna check out the camps bay a bit and over here we have a ferrari 250 california replica so not real gents and this is quite cool or oh, at least to me sl600 v12 yeah you don't see too many of those Here there is. Another AMG GT. Last GT4. And then finally, I just wanted to show you this stunning Porsche GT2 RS finished in white. I think these actually look super clean in this color, even though it's such a basic color for a car. Um, this one isn't a vice hack pack, but it does have the carbon bonnet, as you can see, and a few other carbon extras, uh, like the vent and the wing in the back there. But Gianna, super, super sick to see this car parked up here. But on that note, gents, I think I'm going to end the vlog here. Um, hope you guys enjoyed the video. There is going to be plenty of content coming in the next uh, couple of months, so be sure to stay tuned for that. And uh, I'll see you on the next one. Cheers.